frequency composition technique of an FM. Frequency compensation compensation frequency compensation technique technique of the techniques frequency compensation techniques of the operational amplifier operational amplifier Frequency compensation techniques of the operational amplifier. External compensation techniques. External, external compensation techniques. Compensation techniques. There are two types of external compensation techniques. First one is a dominant fold compensation. Dominant fold compensation technique. Second one is a fold zero, fold zero compensation technique. Compensation technique. The compensation network is connected to the system externally to alter the response as per requirement. The compensation, the compensation network, the compensation network is uh, connected, connected uh, to the system, the system externally, externally to to change the to change the response to change the frequency response or response as per requirements as per requirements first one is a dominant pole compensation first one is Dominant, dominant uh, fold compensation technique. Technique. Consider a FM with the three break frequencies. Three stages of an FM. The open loop gain of an amp amp as a function of frequencies. First one is a first point. Consider an amp amp. Consider an amp amp with the three with three break frequencies. Frequency the, these break frequencies are f one comma f two one. F3. Three individual consider three individual uh, stages of an amp. -amp. Three these three individual stages of an amp, -amp introduces three capacitive effects. Due to these three capacitive effects, we will consider three break frequencies because uh, the gain of an amp, -amp uh, decreases at a higher frequency. Gain of an amp, -amp rolls off at higher frequencies. The open loop, the open loop, the open loop gain, gain of an up amp, as a function of frequency, as a function of frequency, can be written as can be written as KYL of F 
This is the function of frequency. A O L at a zero H frequency by three corner frequencies F1, F2, and F3. This one is the one plus J F by F1, one plus J F by F2, and one plus J F by F3. Consider external composition network that is connected in series with that one. The AOL of F is the uncompensated transfer function of the, of the of M in open loop condition. This is the of M. Transfer function is a AOL. Two inputs. V1 and V2 less and minus. One output that is V not dash. Some compensated network connected in series with that uh, uncompensated network. This is the compensated simple comp simple uh, RC compensated network. This one is one by one j omega c capacitor reactance when is b not this one is a compensation network compensation network this is why this is less dominant pole. Dominant pole is introduced by adding a compensation network externally. These are the three poles or three break frequencies F1, F2, F3. How to introduce uh, another uh, pole that is called as a dominant pole? The dominant pole is, is introduced with the help of uh, this uh, external uh, compensation network. The dominant pole. The dominant, the dominant pole is introduced, is introduced by adding a, by adding a compensation network, by adding a compensation network externally. Compensation network externally or a compensation network is a simple RC network connected in series with the uncompensated network. By adding, by adding, by adding RC network. In series, in series with the with uncompensated network, with uncompensated network. This is the AOL gain, open loop gain at zero frequency. This one is a uncompensated network. Uncompensated uh, half amp, half amp network. We want to introduce a dominant for a simple RC network is connected in series with the uncompensated network, uncompensated half amp network. By using this one, you have to introduce some dominant for. The dominant pole means poles with the magnitude much smaller than the existing poles. These are the uncompensated network. Three poles are available. There are three break frequencies, F1, F2, and F3. 
here dominant pole frequency is f2 fd the dominant pole means the pole with magnitude much smaller than the existing poles dominant the dominant uh, the dominant pole the dominant pole means the pole with the pole with magnitude the pole with magnitude much smaller much smaller than the existing poles much smaller than the existing poles zero less than that means zero less than fd less than f1 less than f2 less than f3 the break frequency of the compensate network is smallest compared to existing break frequencies this one next point the break the break frequency the break frequency fd the break frequency fd of the compensation compensating network compensating network is the smallest is the smallest compared to the compared to the existing compared to the existing break frequencies these are the f1 f2 and f3 are the existing break frequencies by using uh, some external uh, compensating network that is rc network connected in series with the uncompensated network with a foliage dominant foliage fd that freak that freak break frequency is fd that is smallest compared to existing existing uh, uh, break frequencies next one this one uh, aol is the open loop gain of an uh, aol is the open loop gain of an of an that is a uh, gain of that uncompensated network Next one is A dash A one. A one is the gain of the compensated network. Therefore, overall gain is equal to A dash is equal to A O L into A O L of function f into A one. Overall gain. This one is a compensated network. uncompensated network this one is uncompensated network uncompensated network this one is compensated network compensated network is connected in series with the uncompensated network here uh, the gain function the open loop gain of an of n as a function of frequency here f here open loop gain of that uh, compensated network that is represented by e a1 overall gain overall gain a dash is equal to e o l of f into e1 where e1 is the open loop gain transfer function open loop gain transfer function of the of amp that is open loop gain transfer function of the compensated network or transfer function or transfer function of compensated network compensated network This one is the uh, input voltage is VID. Y O L is equal to V dash V naught dash by VID. 
here v naught dash here v naught therefore a1 is equal to v naught by v naught dash a1 is equal to a1 is equal to v naught by v naught dash that is uh, r 1 by j omega c this one is uh, v naught dash this one is v naught v naught dash is equal to v naught is equal to v naught dash into according to voltage division rule v naught dash into 1 by j omega c by r plus 1 by j omega c 1 by v naught dash 1 by j 2 pi f into c r plus r into j 2 pi f c plus 1 by j 2 pi f c these two are cancelled therefore v naught by v naught dash is equal to 1 by j 2 pi r c plus 1 I have to define uh, break frequency of that uh, compensated network this one is a1 fd is equal to 1 by 2 pi into rc 2 pi rc is equal to 1 by fd this is the break frequency of the compensated network that is equal to 1 by 1 plus j here f is also there 2 pi FRC, F by FT, A1. Therefore, overall transfer function, consider both uh, uncompensated network and uh, compensated network. The overall transfer function A dash is equal to A into AOL into A1. AOL is a function of frequency. A1 is a function of frequency. AOL of F is equal to AOL at F is equal to 0H by consider three systems, individual systems with the three corner frequencies. 1 plus J into F by F1. 1 plus J into F by F2. 1 plus J into F by F3 and A1 of F is equal to A1 of F one plus J F by F T because by because the introduced here is a zero less than F D less than F one less than F two less than F three. This is the dominant pole. Introduce this is the dominant pole or uh, compensated network break over frequency introduced by that uh, simple RC network that is connected in series with the uncompensated network. The values of FD is equal to 1 by 2 pi RC. FD is equal to 1 by 2 pi RC. The values of R and C are selected in such a way that the open loop gain drops to 0 dP with a slope of minus 20 dB per decade. Instead of uh, minus 20, minus 40, minus 60 dB per decades, by adding this dominant pole, 
the gain open loop gain of an half amp decreases at a rate of minus 20 dB for decade minus 20 dB for decade only. The values of the values of R and C are selected selected in such a way that in such a way that the loop gain, the loop gain, open loop gain, open loop gain of the top M, that is magnitude function, drops to, drops to 0 dB with a slope of, with a slope of minus 20 dB per decade. Now we'll see the response of that system, frequency response. F versus mod K dash. Mod A dash. Both compensation consider overall uh, function, transfer function A dash is a function of uh, frequency. The, you know, A dash is a function of frequency that is considered magnitude one. Initially, three corner frequencies. This one is the first one, F1, F1 corner frequency. This one is uh, F2. This one is F3. By introducing a dominant pole with the help of external compensated network, compensation network that is connected in series with the uncompensated network, the gain of that open loop gain of that half amp decreases at a rate of minus 20 dB for decade only. With corner frequencies or FD, corner frequencies FD or break frequencies FD. Here, the gain is decreased minus 20 dB per decade, minus 40 dB per decade, minus 60 dB per decade. By adding some dominant pole here, with a frequency, with the break frequencies FD, the gain is decreases under reach to 0 dB and, and, meet, and meet the pole at F is equal to F1. At F is equal to F1, where F1 is the break frequency of that uncompensated network. This is the decreases, the gain is decreases and the meet the 0 dB. This is the 0 dB. And meet the 0 dB at the at other pole F1 of other pole F1 of AOL. That is the gain cross power frequency F1. This one is, this one is FD. FD less than F1, F1 less than F2, F2 less than F3. Here, 
consider a bandwidth. Minus 3 dB down here. This one is 106 dB. Minus 3 dB means 106 minus 3, 103 dB. This one. one is FD. This one is BW2. Bandwidth of that uh, compensated network. 3 dB down bandwidth for non compensated system and compensated system. This one is here. Uh, PW1, PW1, 3 dB down, 3 dB down bandwidth for non compensated, for non compensated, non compensated system is BW1. BW1 is the uh, system is BW1 because corner frequencies are three break frequencies are introduced here. While while for compensated it becomes uh, while for compensated network compensated network uh, it becomes it becomes PW2. There is a drastic reduction in the bandwidth. There is a drastic, drastic reduction, drastic reduction in, in the bandwidth of the top end. Bandwidth of the top end. BW1 bandwidth of that uncompensated network. BW2 is the bandwidth of that uh, compensated network. This is the bandwidth. This is another bandwidth. Compare these two. For uncompensated network, bandwidth uh, drastically reduces. Advantages. 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 Advantage is uh, as the noise frequency components are outside outside the smaller bandwidth. Noise, more noise frequency components are uh, outside that uh, outside the smaller bandwidth. So the noise frequency come outside the smaller bandwidth. This will uh, introduce us, uh, the noise immunity of the system improves as the noise uh, frequency the noise frequency components components are outside the outside the smaller bandwidth Therefore, the noise, uh, the noise immunity, immunity of the system improves. Compensated uh, network break frequency is FD. The value of uh, FD is uh, Adjusted by using by changing R and C values of the compensated network. That is the another advantage. Second advantage by adjusting values of uh, FD, 
Therefore, we will get uh, more stability of the system. By changing the by changing the by changing the values of R and C such that we have to select have to select a proper value of FD for better improvement. Improvement. The main disadvantage of that system is a disadvantage. The main disadvantage of that system is gain is decreases drastically. The only disadvantage of that method is not gain, the bandwidth reduction drastically. The only disadvantage Disadvantage, disadvantage of that method is method is, uh, is that bandwidth bandwidth uh, reduces drastically with this uh, the analysis of the dominant pole compensation method is completed. This is the compensated network transfer. Uncompensated network transfer function is AYL of F. Compensated network transfer function A1 of F. A dash of F is equal to AYL of F into A1 of F. With this the analysis is